Hey guys, y'all are here fast these days. So I wasn't um, planning on making a video because I'm just, uh, I'm on different assignments, but <laughs> y'all are so funny. Y'all don't, y'all don't ever like learn anything, but um, let me go ahead and tell y'all a little bit more truth today on the Sabbath day, a Saturday, today's Saturday, right? Is it Friday or Saturday? I don't know, but it's the weekend, I think, and it, um somebody's been leaving comments oh y'all oh y'all so y'all get so triggered by me it's actually very funny to me and uh, very highly entertaining because who sits there like i don't ever like sit around here and like stalking some girl's profile getting all like obsessed with her and like you know you know just leaving comments on her page and like who does that a bunch of losers like i don't ever do that if there's somebody i don't like which is very like rare because i don't really go out of my way to be around people I don't like, you know what I'm saying? Uh, but if there's someone that I don't like, I, you will never catch me like being up all their page, all their social media, seeing like obsessed about them like they are with me. And then they're, they're coming here all triggered. Like you get, you get to feel all their jealousy just pouring out. That's why God chose me. That's why Jesus married me, bro, to uh, trigger you fake Christians you know, like this, this witch been commenting on all my videos and uh, posts all morning. Like, uh, she's like, I tell you, you're going to hell, I say. To hell, you're going blasphemous. And I'm like, uh, sorry to say this, sweetie. But, uh, you know, Jesus says the whores get to heaven first. Before, you know, anybody else, the whores and the tax collectors go to heaven first. <laughs> Oops. And, uh, you know. And then she left another comment saying the same thing, all angry, like, you're a whore. I'm like, oh, <laughs> sorry. They said the same thing about Mary Magdalene, but guess what? Jesus loved her the most. <laughs> sorry, guys. Sorry that uh, Jesus loves me the most, and I'm just this whore. Uh, but he says, hey, this whore, she's going to heaven first. Now, I wanted to, uh, ex you know, talk more about that because a lot of people miss that. It's so small that they miss it where the Lord said, you know, I'll tell you the truth. Uh, the, these whores and the tax collectors will get into the kingdom of heaven first before you. So what does that imply? That implies that there's a group of people that will get into heaven first before you. So it's not a thing where it's just like a like the mankind all at one time get into heaven. You see, there's a group of people that gets to go to heaven first before any of y'all, you. So that includes me, the whore. So how do I know the Lord so much? How can I come back to the earth? You know, and I told you how, you know, Lucifer and me, I've been given power to travel amongst, uh, uh, you know, amongst the fiery stones, which means uh, the stars, different planets, different heavens. How do I know all this stuff, bro? How do I know all this wisdom? Obviously, it comes from God. It comes from God. You ain't getting this kind of wisdom nowhere else. This kind of special uh, keys unlocking the mysteries of the Bible. Who else in the whole planet told you what the fiery stones meant? Nobody, bro, but me. A lot of shit I didn't told y'all here in my ministry ain't no pastor in the whole universe fucking knew about, bro. I knew about that shit. How do I know all this shit? Uh, unless if I made it up, how, how did I become so highly advanced and intelligent to travel ahead of myself to make up stuff that fits the Bible perfectly? And, and with your life events too on the earth with the Kobe death and all this stuff that mirrors what's happening with me in the heavens. And how, how do I know all this stuff and what it means? Unless, unless that wisdom, you know, because I'm wisdom in the beginning, she was with God. So how do I know this stuff? How do I have so much confidence in the Lord? Confidence in the Lord? How can I just be this way? And like, how do I speak on His behalf? And how how come with as many people rebuking me in His name, praying about me, praying against me? How come ain't none of y'all prayers worked? I thought God was all powerful. Isn't He all powerful? Doesn't He work everything for the greater good? Doesn't He destroy enemies? I mean, if I was truly, you know. Uh, blaspheming against the Lord, which, by the way, I am the Holy Spirit of truth. <laughs> so it is y'all blaspheming against me, and you, you are the ones who are not forgiven for that. 
But anyways, that's why Jesus said, listen, you can blast, you know, you can talk crap about me all you want, bro. But if you talk crap about my wife, bro, her spirit, you know, your mom, you ain't never going to be forgiven for that shit, bro. Because Jesus like, don't ever disrespect your mother. You know, she done birth you. Like all y'all who have mothers, you know. Uh, Y'all gonna disrespect your mom? Like, you, you gonna just talk crap to her? Like, the woman who, you know, birthed you and carried you in her womb and took care of you and nursed you when you were a child, you know? Like, <laughs> but anyway, so I wanted to uh, talk about that, you know. Jesus does say that there's a group of people that get into heaven first before you. So that's how I know all this stuff because I have already made my way into heaven, bro. I'm already in the mountain of God. I'm already in Mount Zion with God. I have full access to go into the um, um, into the Mount Zion with God to see Him face to face, to be with Him face to face, and be become one with Him and enter into the Holy of Holies. I get to do that. And then after that, I also have access to come back to the earth. That's what walking amongst the fiery stones means. Because listen, bro, if you you don't have that passport into heaven, you don't have the rights, the legal rights to travel to outer space, to travel to different planetary worlds. That's why everybody on earth can't even go past the fake moon landing because y'all ain't been given the passport from God yet, bro. You can't just enter into somebody else's territory without your passport. I mean, on earth as it is in heaven, you can't travel to France and go to the airport and be like, I want to get in. And they're like, well, where's your fucking passport, bro? Uh, you got to go back. We got border patrols up in here. You got border patrols on the earth, you know. And if you don't think we got border patrols up in heaven, bro, you're trying to go up in there and without your fucking passport. And they're like, oh, hell no. You better go back to the lower parts of the earth where you're from. You better go back to hell where you're from, bro. What are you trying to do up here? You're like, well, uh, I don't have a passport, but, but, no, nah, no buts, nigga. Go back down there where you came from. Go back from whence you came, nigga. So, but I've been given full access. So that's why I have all this crazy wisdom, all this crazy knowledge. And that's why I'm so highly hated because just my mere existence like puts all these uh, Pharisees to shame. And obviously uh, they haven't changed since. Sorry, guys, I haven't. <laughs> they haven't changed since uh, back in Jesus time. You see, Jesus was the truth. He came to speak about the truth and they still reject him. And they were puffing their chest at him like blasphemous. They're calling him the devil, a demon. They're rebuking him, you know, talking about we are the children of Abraham. We're the children of God. So the same thing they do to me, his wife. They're like, eh, I, you put us real Christians to shame. You blasphemous, you whore. You might as well be a stripper. And that's what they did to Mary Magdalene. They threw her on the ground. It was like, we got to stone her ass. She's a whore. Jesus like, uh... <laughs> I'm about to marry this whore just to just to piss you the fuck off. I'm going to marry this whore and I'm going to have her talking all kinds of craziness and let her do whatever she want to do. Just y'all get teeth gnash and think you're so holy. And then when I, you know, when I finally do come, you're going to see her right next to me. Oh, y'all got to be teeth gnashing. Woo, got to be a teeth gnashing party, bro. So uh, just keep that in mind next time you will come at me, bro. And they get so angry because they know I'm right. Like, I didn't make this shit up, bro. Jesus, you know, everybody hated Mary Magdalene. They hated on even Jesus' disciples was hating on Mary Magdalene. Peter was hating on Mary Magdalene because he's like, you know. And then uh, Simon or one of the other disciples, uh, this is in the Lost Book of Thomas. And they're like, uh Surely uh, the Lord, she know the Lord knows Mary because he loves her the most out of all of us. He loves Mary the most. And that's why Peter, all the men were hating on her because they wanted to be, they thought they were closest to the Lord and they thought like having a woman around would be too, you know, uh, because they're always beating down on women. But they knew Jesus loved Mary the most out of all of them. I mean, when he first came back from the dead, when he resurrected from the dead, who was the first person he, he revealed himself to? Was not Peter. Was not John, was not was not any of those disciples. Who did he go to first? Can anyone answer me this question? Who did Jesus uh, come to first after he was ro risen from the dead? I'm waiting. I'm waiting. Me, that's right, me, Mary Magdalene. Very good. <laughs> Mary Jane, bitch. <laughs> So, uh, you know, in the Bible, is the same thing in this, you know, in this parallel universe. Who did he come to first? Me, nigga. After he died, you know, y'all think, oh, he died, but he's alive somewhere. Yeah, he already came to me. His wife, Mary Magdalene. Why did he go to Peter first? 
Why did he go to John first? Why did he go to the whore first? Why did he go to this whore first? This whore, this stripper, this porn star. He came to me first. Uh, are you blasphemous? Bitch, it's the Bible, ho. <laughs> you just mad because I'm telling the truth, nigga. <laughs> he came to me first. We done made love and everything because, you know, I went to heaven to do that shit, bro. And uh, all this stuff, it was happening in the heavens. But anyways, uh, I, I don't really read the comments too much. I mean, the chat room too much because uh, it's too low IQ for me. If I read anything too low IQ for a short amount of time, it like my brain melts because, you know, I don't want to cast my pearls before the swine uh, because it's constantly like, you know. So I don't read anything low IQ. Anything low IQ, I'm just like, you know, I just ignore it. Uh, but when you get a little bit higher IQ, maybe then we can have a conversation because then we can be kind of on the same level. But y'all got a long way to go for that. But anyways, praise the Lord for us hookers and whores. Ooh, girl, what's going on? Thick mama, so juicy. Girl, you got that yummy, yum, that yummy, yum, that yummy. <laughs> you know, he wrote that song about me, nigga. <laughs> y'all tripping, ho. But, uh, yeah, even when I just woke up, I haven't even showered yet, nigga. I've been looking fly, nigga. <laughs> Girl, you got that yummy, yo. Ooh, look at this whore. Ooh. Your own personal Jesus. Someone that'll hear your prayers. Someone who cares. <laughs> the Lord said to walk in love. Ain't none of y'all bitches, especially y'all bitches hating on me. Y'all don't walk in love at all. Y'all bitches get so triggered by my videos. Like, <laughs> you fuck. You're going to hell, I say. To hell. <laughs> Bitch, I ain't where you at, ho. <laughs> the whores go to heaven first. Nigga, the Lord says, this bitch, this whore right here, she going to heaven first. <laughs> <laughs> These bitches are <laughs> to hell. You're going to hell. I say, bitch, I ain't where you at, bro. I ain't where you at. That's why I never hate on y'all. You see how I never hate on people? I'm just living my own fucking life, minding my own fucking business. You know, not hurting anybody. Just making my fucking videos, like minding my own fucking business. Y'all can't deny it. I'll be minding my own fucking business. It ain't my fault, you bitch asses. Y'all bitches out there so fucking goddamn nosy. Try to creep up in my channel. Be gossiping about me everywhere. You know, all these women around here out there, they always talk about me everywhere I go. They be calling their family like, hey, cousin, guess who's here? You know, they, they just talk and talk and everybody just talk, bro. The Lord says, shut your fucking mouth. You gossiping bitches ain't getting into heaven. Didn't y'all know that? He says... All you whore, you know, you, uh, you know, sexually immoral, all the homosexuals, you know, the, the fearful, you know, all that shit. Y'all, all the people gossiping, you know, y'all ain't getting into heaven, but guess who's getting into heaven? Not only am I getting to heaven, I get into heaven first before you. The Lord says the whore gets into heaven first before you. <laughs> y'all bitches are mad, bro. So what's heaven like? Well, first of all, the Lord says, baby girl. <laughs> he says, you know, uh, you a grown woman, but you my baby girl. Ooh, daddy. <laughs> I love that daddy. Daddy, is, he got some moves, bro. When you get to know daddy, he, he's, he, he's really smooth. I mean, who, who says that? He, he's, he's like, you a grown ass woman, but you, you still my baby girl. <gasps> oh, yes, daddy. Only daddy knows how to say something fucking smooth like that. So, um, anyway, so he said, baby girl, what, what kind of heaven would you like me to make for you? Just for you. And he's like, I know what you like, baby girl. I'm like, what, what do I like, daddy? <laughs> he's like, well, you, you got that foul mouth, which you love, you know? So, so he made me my own little like paradise in heaven. Cause you know, if you think about it, if you go to heaven, what's heaven like to you? What's heaven like to you? If you can think of anything, it's like, okay, if you, if you go to heaven one day, if you make it there, right, and you tell the Lord, like, okay, Lord, I got this thing for, like, Victoria's Secret Models. Can you just put me on a planet where I got, like, all these Victoria's Ch Secret Models chasing after just me? He's like, sure, of course, you deserve it. You can have whatever you want. And then he's like, Ugh. he makes a simulation just for you, and he puts you on your own freaking heaven, and you got all these Victoria's Secret Models running, chasing you around. That's your heaven, bro. 
So what's my heaven? I'm like, nigga, ha <laughs> I love saying nigga, bro. Ha <laughs> Suck my dick, nigga. <laughs> He's like, girl, you bad. I'm like, yeah, I know. I'm a bad bitch. <laughs> Where do you think that term came from, ho? The bad bitch. <laughs> So he's like, you a bad little bitch. I love you, girl. I love you, girl. I was like, thanks, daddy. So uh, then he made this whole heaven for me. And he's like, you can do whatever you want. Anybody got a problem with you, let me know who. So I'm going to go into the book of life, cross their names out. I'm crossing their names out. So who else try to come at you? Oops, I don't know. <laughs> they got disappeared. <laughs> they got deleted. <laughs> they just disappeared because Father God just deleted them from the book of life. He said, anyone come at you in the slightest bit of judgment. Boom, done. Deleted. Off. Done. <laughs> Off with their heads. So, uh, I just want to come and tell you and remind y'all that. So, every day, listen, bro, I never judge nobody. When I'm out there, like, I never judge nobody. Like, even if they're doing bad, even if they're, because I know people be, uh, the Lord puts me into the paths of my own enemies. Uh, I, I know that by now. So, just so they can see how good I am actually to them. So, I do really good to all my enemies. I always take care of them. I'm there for them. I, I watch their kids. You know, I feed them. I do whatever, you know, I, I'm just so kind to them. Because I know they're my enemy. Because the Lord told me to do good to my enemies. So they, they start gnashing their teeth at me. Because they're like, wow, she she really is nice. You know, I don't have anything bad to say about her. I wish I did. So then they come on to my YouTube videos. Because that's the only thing they can say. They're like, well, on her YouTube video, she's she's being blasphemous. Like, bitch, <laughs> it's a fucking YouTube video, ho. <laughs> if you go to my fucking uh, homepage about me, it literally says... I had to put this in because people became so dumb. I'm like, this gel is satire. <laughs> you fucking idiots. <laughs> it's so stupid. Ooh, Lord. Lord, I see why they're in hell. <laughs> I mean, he even calls you, you swine. The Lord even calls you swine. He's like, don't cast your pearls before the swine. These are swine right here. Like, uh, bro, he called you swine. He called you dogs. Like, he called you beasts. Like, you know, unclean fowls, you know. <laughs> My baby's so funny. So, you know, all these, like, witches, all these women, like, be, they begin so jealous over me, bro. They like, you're going to hell. These are the literal words she used to say. You're going to hell, I say. To hell you go. I'm like... <laughs> I don't know. Boo thinks Jesus don't think so. He says she's going to heaven first. <laughs> oh, I gotta love it. He came to Mary Magdalene first after he died. And she was crying, remember? Because after my boo thing died, I was crying too. I was like, you know, and he's like, woman, why are you crying? I'm like, because my best friend just died. You know, he's like, he's like, uh, I'm right here. I'm like, I'm like, my, my love? And he's like, go, go tell everyone. So I came back here to tell everyone, but I'm like, my love, they ain't never changed. And for 2,000 years, like, beyond, they have not changed at all. Like, it's time to drop that bomb on them. It's like, are you serious? I'm like, yeah, not only have they not changed, they got it worse, too. It's like, oh, hell no. I'm about to drop a bomb on these people. I'm like, yes, please, please do. <laughs> but I ain't going to be affected by it because I'm operating in, in heaven already with my boo so anyways i feel sorry for y'all <laughs> so anyways yeah they got worse uh but for those few of you here who do see the truth god bless you we we up in heaven bro we're having a good time we having sex up in here Woo! <laughs> And all kinds of fun things going on here. And because uh, it's my heaven, bro. I, I, you know, I got the keys to the kingdom of heaven, to hell. I can do whatever. I, want. I can torment my enemies in the lake of fire, you know. All the people that was already cast out. You know, I can come back and torment them all I want. That's why they hate me so much. Uh, but anyways, that's all I wanted to tell y'all. Because, you know. <sighs> hey. These bitches be hating. They're so triggered because you're my king and I'm the queen. <gasps> I'm God's princess. I'm his begotten daughter, his beloved daughter that he set up with his son, Jesus. So he, he's like, yes, my queen. Tell him the truth. Hit him where it hurts because I, I will always back you up. Always. Really, daddy? Thanks, Daddy. 
you're so sweet. I would rather lose a lover than a lover loser. Rather lose a lover than a lover loser. I think I'm under your spell. Tell me, is it me or the drugs? Cause baby, I can't tell. I can't tell. Daddy loves when I serenade him. Oh, yes, sir. <laughs> you bitch is crazy. Oh, you're so jealous. But look at me one more time and be all jealous, bro. Oh, the queen just sit up in her throne like, hey, daddy. Hey, look at that. God bless you, dear. Yes, to hell I go, I say. Oh, God, please save me, Jesus. It's okay, because if I am going to hell, guess who's the first one there to save me? Ah! <laughs> I'm like, Daddy, help me. I think I'm going to hell. Jesus. And then he's like, what is it, my love? How can I save you today? I'm like, Daddy, I'm going to hell. He's like, no, you're not. Grab onto my hand. Ah! <laughs> No matter what I do to you, I'll be winning. <laughs> Daddy, help me. I'm, I'm dying. 